I began with one very simple question. Can an AI create the perfect image of a spaceship? Well, it turns out that was a pretty big ask, even for some of the better publicly available image generators. Unfortunately, none of them were quite perfect, but as you'll see further into the video, it really did make a very bold attempt. Now, everything you've seen on the screen right here has been created by an artificial intelligence called Midjourney. Midjourney is an invite-only AI image generator that currently runs through Discord. Like other AI image generators, Midjourney works by accepting the text input and then attempting to visualize that text. It's also worth keeping in mind that Midjourney is very much focused on creating art rather than anything photoreal. Now, if you're lucky enough to get an invite, you'll get about 20 image generations for your particular use, and that will uh, pretty much expire your trial basis. After that, there is a subscription here. Uh, that is $10 a month for 200 images, or $30 a month for unlimited images. Now, as with all of these AI image generators out there, you may have seen the DALI or even tried DALI Mini. They aren't always perfect, and that's because the AI doesn't seem to understand the language in the same way we do. It means that things can get a little bit tricky when considering which text inputs to use. But this really is something that comes with experimentation, time and familiarity. To see how effective Midjourney is though, a quick look through Discord and we can quickly see the types of images that people are creating right now. So in my opinion, some really fantastic results here. So, those are spaceships. It turns out that spaceships are a subject that every AI image generator I used seem to struggle with. It's likely that all of this is because the AIs rely upon public sources to build context. Unsurprisingly, there isn't a whole lot of context out there on exactly what a spaceship should be and what it shouldn't be. But even with that in mind, it turns out that it's very important to give Midjourney as much information for reference as possible. So, looking at the image from the thumbnail. This is a futuristic concept spaceship in a hangar. Now this is an image I especially liked. There's quite a few recognizable elements in here. The fuselage and the canopy at the front particularly stand out to me. I really like the lighting here as well. So how do we use Midjourney? Well, it's relatively straightforward. As I say, it currently works through Discord. Once logged in, you simply type in your text prompt. So here we want a spaceship flying in the sky in the style of Metrovania art, Symphony of the Night, as well as Breath of the Wild. We want an aspect ratio of 16 by 9. So we can see that this is a shared channel. There's other people also creating images within this same area, but we're going to focus on our one right here. So currently a 26% generated. It takes a little while to figure it out. It's going to give us four different options. So I'm going to speed that up a little bit here just to make things a little bit quicker. And there we go, nearly done. So once this is generated, we've got four separate images and we can choose to either upscale these or create further variations. The further variations is a great way to get improved iterations upon a particular design if you happen to like that one. But we're going to upscale two of these, this one here, as well as variation number four. Again, I'm going to quickly speed that up and here we go with the final result. Again, as I mentioned previously, these images do tend to be very artistic, but that is the intent of Midjourney. So yeah, this is very much in keeping with the request, a spaceship in the style of Castlevania and Zelda. Alternatively, anything reflecting Warhammer-style art was suitably, well, Warhammery. These ones in particular, I felt were especially grim dark. Ultimately then, adding further context to text prompts is what really helped out a lot. This could be describing the environment in detail or naming a particular artist that should be used as inspiration. In the end then, Midjourney was able to generate some pretty impressive images of spaceships Whilst none of them are what I would call perfect, it's very important to remember that Midjourney and AI image creation in general is still very early on in its life. It's also been worked on very hard with almost daily improvements. Anyway, here's a few more AI images of spaceships for you to look at. 